the dog looked into the storm drain every day, and when it was opened, people were shocked. Have you ever wondered what could happen if a stray dog living on the streets suddenly started doing something that nobody could understand? We all know that stray dogs are often left to fend for themselves, but what if one of them had a secret that would amaze everyone? Hi everyone. Today, I'm going to share with you the unbelievable story of Benny, a stray dog whose actions led to a shocking discovery that no one could have ever expected. Join us here in Animals Need Love as we dive into the journey of Benny. In the quiet neighborhood of Willow Street, residents had become accustomed to seeing a German Shepherd standing near a storm drain every day. Passers-by often wondered what could possibly be holding her attention for so long and why she stood so still, staring down into the drain as if waiting for something. At first, it seemed like nothing more than a peculiar habit, but as time passed, people started to wonder what exactly the dog was so fixated on and what she was waiting for. One day, while walking his own dog, Dave noticed the German Shepherd again. She stood motionless by the drain, eyes fixed on the opening. No owner was in sight, and the dog seemed perfectly content to remain in that spot day after day. At first, Dave thought little of it. Dogs had their quirks, after all. But the next day, there she was again, standing in the exact same spot, staring down at the drain. And the day after that, the same routine. Dave couldn't shake the feeling that something wasn't quite right, but he didn't know what to make of it. He continued his walks, but the image of the dog's intense gaze haunted him. By the third day, Dave's curiosity had gotten the better of him. He couldn't stop thinking about the dog and the drain. Was something wrong? Was the dog stuck? Or perhaps it was waiting for someone? With growing unease, Dave decided he had to find out what was going on. He grabbed his dog and walked toward the drain, determined to observe the situation more closely. As they neared the spot, the German Shepherd was still there her eyes fixed downward. Dave hesitated for a moment, unsure of what he might discover. He watched for several minutes, but nothing seemed to change. The dog didn't move. The air was thick with silence, and Dave couldn't shake the feeling that he was witnessing something strange. Dogs, he knew, were loyal and reliable companions. There had to be a reason for her behavior. He wondered if he should step in and help, but his instincts told him that there was more to this than he could handle alone. Just as Dave was about to take action, the shrill wail of a fire truck pierced through the quiet neighborhood, signaling the arrival of the professionals. The fire department had been alerted, and the team arrived swiftly, ready to assess the situation. With practice precision, the crew worked quickly to open the storm drain. As they made their way toward the drain, the noise from within grew louder and Dave's pulse quickened with anticipation. He had no idea what was down there, but he was eager to find out. His heart raced with a mixture of excitement and anxiety. Despite Dave's eagerness to discover what was inside the drain, the authorities stopped him from getting too close. They informed him that the area had been cordoned off for safety reasons. Lifting the drain cover could be dangerous, they warned, especially with the uncertainty of what might be lurking underneath. Dave was frustrated, but he knew that they were just being cautious. The rescue team was already at work, and he had to trust that they knew what they were doing. As the firefighters carefully pried open the drain, Dave's mind raced with questions. What was down there? Why had the dog been so fixated on it? His thoughts were interrupted when a flurry of activity began near the storm drain. The noise grew louder and Dave's heart beat faster with anticipation. What had been hidden below all this time? He couldn't help but feel a sense of dread and excitement at the same time. Then the police began to question them. Dave was sitting next to a group of cops who looked very serious. A lot of questions were asked about the dog, the drain, and his part in it. He didn't know why they were questioning him at first. 
they asked him if he had seen anything strange or out of the ordinary, and why he was so interested in the dog. This made his mind run as Dave tried to say that he was only trying to help. His hands got cold and his throat got tight, but it looked like no one heard what he said. It looked like the police were not trusting, like they thought there was more to the story. As things got more tense, Dave noticed a white tent being set up next to the drain. He got a chill when he saw it. What was going on? The officials were very worried about what was going on. Whatever was in that drain was making a lot of noise. When Dave learned that things had gotten much worse than he thought they would, his confusion grew even stronger. Suddenly, an officer turned to the crowd and shouted, Everyone, stay back! This is an active investigation. Dave's heart raced. What had been hidden there all this time? He turned to Benny, who still hadn't moved, still staring down at the open drain, her body rigid. The firefighters pulled out what appeared to be a large metal crate, covered in decades-old rust and grime. They carefully set it down, and it seemed like everyone in the crowd collectively held their breath. The crate was heavy, so they needed a team of people to open it. When the lid was finally lifted, it revealed hundreds of packages, tightly wrapped in brown paper, stamped with strange cryptic symbols. The crowd gasped. No one knew what they were looking at, but it was clear that these packages were something important. Benny stood tail wagging, her body shifting as if she were finally relieved that the secret had been uncovered. The officer in charge, now visibly rattled, signaled for the packages to be moved to a secure location. But it wasn't just the contents of the crate that shocked everyone, it was what the officer said next. We've been looking for these, he muttered. These were supposed to be destroyed years ago. The officer's words left the crowd in stunned silence. What did he mean? What were these packages? And why had they been hidden in a storm drain for so long? A few hours later, the mystery was partially revealed to the public. The packages were filled with confidential government documents, blueprints for a series of top secret projects, research notes on military experiments, and photographs of unidentified locations. These were classified files that had been smuggled out of a government facility over two decades ago. Documents that were never supposed to see the light of day. But the most jaw-dropping part? Benny wasn't just a stray dog. She had been a part of the operation all along. Unbelievably, Benny was no ordinary dog. She had been trained as a service dog for an undercover government operation, which involved her being used to guard sensitive information. Benny had been unknowingly part of a covert program. Given the task of protecting the storm drain that contained the crate of classified documents, it was revealed that Benny had been living with a retired agent, Mrs. Ada Thompson, who had worked for the government on top secret missions after Mrs. Thompson's death, Benny, confused and lost without her owner, continued to return to the spot where she had always guarded the crate. It was instinct. Benny had been programmed, trained to protect this specific location, even if she had no memory of why. She had been the dog of an agent who had gone into hiding after uncovering a conspiracy that no one was meant to know about. In a twist of fate, Benny's routine had unwittingly led to the unmasking of one of the most shocking government cover-ups in decades. Once the crates were taken to a secure government building, the news of the finding spread like wildfire. Once a mysterious stray, Benny was now the unexpected hero. Community members helped find the lost files, and government officials involved in the operation thanked them and said, that was the last anyone would hear about it. Luckily for Benny, the task was over. People in the neighborhood came together to support her after learning about the dog's secret past. Because she was so loyal, Dave legally adopted Benny. She became a symbol of strength and a reminder of how weirdly love and loyalty 
can get through even the worst scenarios. Benny was done keeping lies. She was finally free to live the quiet, peaceful life she deserved, warmly welcomed by a society that would never forget how brave she had been. And so, after two years of healing, growth, and unexpected adventures, Benny found her forever home with Dave, where love and peace replaced the mysteries of her past. Together, they created a bond that not only changed their lives, but touched the hearts of everyone around them. What do you think of Benny's incredible journey? How do you feel about the bond between a dog and their owner, overcoming even the darkest secrets? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching to the end. If you find our video interesting, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Finally, don't forget to turn on our bell and subscribe to our channel. Animals need love, so you don't miss any of our new videos. Thank you for your support. Wishing you all peace, happiness, take care, and we'll see you in the next one. See you in the next one.